when the internet saw JPEG Mafia and Kanye had actually linked up together and put in work in the studio, there were quite a lot of mixed emotions. But now, on the other side of Vultures 1, I can confidently say Peggy completely elevated the album. I love Leaky! If you don't remember, Peggy and Ye ended up getting together because of a series of tweets where Peggy just totally tore Kanye a new one. He shit on everybody and the production on Vultures in general while also stating that he could easily make things a lot better if Kanye gave him a chance, which is exactly what happened. Only a few days after the tweets, we got pictures of Peggy and Ye chilling together and from there, things really took off in terms of Peggy's involvement production-wise. After the eventual release of Vultures 1, we finally got to see everything Peggy did for the album, and holy shit am I glad that Kanye gave him a chance. Peggy's drums turned stars from a nice and ethereal interlude into something with real substance and backbone that works perfectly as an album intro. His drums also took both Fucksum and King to totally new levels. On Fucksum, the addition of some really rough and raw drums under Kanye's verse made it totally stand out in a song with some super bold production. Hold my coat, hold my drink, on my own, don't want me. Sure they wanna fuck on, sir. Fuck on me, suck on me, publicly. And on King, Peggy's drums replaced what Weezy had done in Saudi Arabia while working for Kanye. After everything you said, huh? Wayne, Wayne, crazy, bipolar, anti-Semite, and I'm crazy, bipolar, anti-Semite, and I'm still the king, still Finally, Peggy basically turned Beg Forgiveness into a total banger by contributing heavily to the song's beat switch that features phenomenal vocals from Ty Dolla Sign. Say you wanna make amends before I go. Now you wanna put your heart on the line. The Beg Forgiveness vocal beat chop is an amazing song outro and the perfect scaffolding for Ty's raw and emotional singing. I think I speak for all of us when I say that we 100% need Peggy to keep working with Kanye on the next volumes of Vultures because he brings a truly unique eye for production to songs. His raw drums are easily some of the best and most unique moments on the album and his versatility is something that can really help Kanye elevate his game even this far into his career. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this, and let me know down in the comments which of Peggy's contributions you like the most.